Hello everybody out there in YouTube land. Today I have with me, it's not really a mystery box, it's more of like a here's what you get kind of a box deal. Um, this was something that was exclusively to GameStop and it's for a game that I hold near and dear to my heart and it is uh, Kingdom Hearts. And this is uh, a mystery box for Kingdom Hearts 3. Now, they kind of did, like, a, a thing where, like, here's everything that you get in this box. Um, you had a 50-50 chance of getting, like, a certain plushie. And there was, like, a Mystery Ink version of Donald or a Mystery Ink version of Goofy. So, I'm, I'm pretty much hoping that I got Donald because he was one that I liked the most, more than Goofy. Uh, not to say that I didn't like Goofy, but, you know, uh, I like Donald more. Um, but here's what, where we open up the box. And as you can see, it's got Kingdom Hearts all over it. Kingdom Hearts 3. You know, it's on the front, it's on the bottom, it's on the back. Uh, and then you have, of course, only at GameStop right on the side of it. So it's not a very big box uh, like the other boxes that I've gotten in the past. But it's still a pretty good sized box. So you pretty much know what the pop already was. And you kind of knew what the other stuff was too. So it looks like the mystery mini, or the, the mystery plush, I should say, that I got is of Donald's. So that's kind of cool. I got the one that I wanted the most. Definitely is always a, a good thing. <clears throat> and then, of course, we have the Keyblade. Now, this is something that I kind of see Funko collaborating with to do, like, more of these. They're, um... A three pack of like if if you can see it they're like different keyblades from the game um they got the shooting star which i believe is the one in the middle then they had the void gear and they have the brave heart that's right there at the end so that's actually pretty cool uh definitely like i said definitely is something that i see kingdom Hearts doing um and funko doing more of as later on in the game progresses and then of course you have the big piece which is actually the piece i wanted the most which is your fungal pop. And it's pretty much of Sora kind of like riding on the pops itself. So it's a bit like if you open it up and you take a look at it, it's basically just like Sora on top of a bunch of heartless. It's kind of like a, maybe like a little teaser towards the game, what's going to happen inside the game, you could say. And it does have one keyblade, so maybe like the other keyblades will fit in his other hand. I haven't really checked yet. I probably won't just so I don't mess up my Funko Pop. Let's see if I can pop real quick. There we go. All right, so this would be the Pop itself. And like I said, this is a, so pretty much just like a Pop of Sora. It's kind of like an action pose kind of deal where he's basically just sort of riding in there. Um, Definitely is very cool. Definitely is something that I like. It's definitely gonna be like a neat little display on my uh on my Funko Pop collection because I don't have any other Funko Pops of Kingdom Hearts. This is actually the only one I have and the only one I wanted the most. So definitely going to keep keep the uh keep this going. So like I said, definitely is something worth getting. It does come at a hefty price, but if you think about it, this is a, de a deluxe pop, so it's kind of worth the hefty price. And if you get on eBay, it's probably just going to be like double the price of it for what people like to put on there. And I honestly would say if you could get this box and you're a Kingdom Hearts fan, I would go for it because you get extra keyblades, you get a mystery mini, a uh, mystery plush, I should say, not a mystery mini. And then of course you get the cool looking Uncle Pop. So that's everything for this unboxing video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like and subscribe to my channel. You have a wonderful day.